Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nick, AKA Loda Wombat, and today I'm gonna to show you how Twitch has changed your offline channel in order to allow you to engage and entertain people even when you're offline. All right, let's jump right into it. You're gonna see really three different things that Twitch did to change this whole channel thing, okay? Number one is this channel trailer. It's like a welcome video or some sort of, you know, way for you to let people know who are just stopping by your page while you're offline, what the heck you're about. So even when you're offline, you can welcome people and let them know about your other socials. You can let them know about YouTube. You can let them know about whatever the heck it is in that channel trailer, which is so freaking awesome. And I love it. Number two, what you're going to see that they changed really is this home screen. I think they're going to make this more customizable as you go. Uh, it doesn't seem very customizable on the home screen, but there is other customizable things. So in the about section, you're going to be able to put your socials linked here so they can click on any of these socials which is really cool they still have your panels so your panels aren't leaving don't worry um and then you go to schedule if you remember we used to have to use a widget for this it had to be something that was added on in our panels this is now within twitch and is right here ready to go what's kind of cool too is if you look this is clickable of something i did this week so tuesday if they miss the stream they can click on this and uh, go to Tuesday. And then these are just the ones coming up. When you look at uh, customizing your channel, you're gonna see an option to go down and go to channel trailer and add a channel trailer. So you can choose a video that you've already downloaded or you can download another video to video producer and put that in. And then right below that, you're gonna see your social links. So you can put all your socials within there, um, but put all your socials in there because if they look at your about me, they're gonna see those. And then you're able to add your uh, stream schedule. We'll just like, I'll show you how to add one. So if you add a stream, you can add it on particular days or, or if you stream the same time every single day, like I do, you can just click through all these and then put the start time, duration, the category you're probably gonna stream, which is a category or which is a required thing, which is kind of weird to me. But then you can tell your viewers what they're in for. I wanna just say one more thing before we end our video here today. Make sure you guys use the tools that Twitch is giving you in order to complete your brand. You are getting a schedule of channel trailer slash welcome video. That's freaking amazing. So make sure you guys use those tools. Now I know this isn't like groundbreaking in terms of giving you tons and tons of viewers, but the reality is small things add up into big things. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. And if you have any thoughts about this or if you think it's awesome or awful or whatever, put those in the comments down below. I wanna hear about it. Also, if you have any questions for me, you can always find me live on stream pretty much every single day right now. I'm going from 10 a.m. to like 6 p.m. Pacific time abouts. And uh, yeah, we'll see you live on stream, baby.